What's going on everybody? It's Hunter here and we need to talk about the $15 minimum wage. This is called the Raise the Wage Act and it is Biden's proposal to raise the minimum wage uh, from $7.25 to $15, so over doubling it. You know, a lot of people have their own opinions about this. The Democrats are going to support it and the Republicans are going to be against it. Um, but I just want to give you some clarity and some insight on uh, what this means, what's going to happen in the future, how it's going to work. So first of all, the $15, it's not like you're going to wake up overnight and and the minimum wage is going to be $15, right? The economy could not sustain that. I'll give you guys a look at the actual uh, bill here and um, we'll walk through the timeline of when the when we could see the wages increase and what it means for you and what you should be doing next. Okay, so here's the bill, HR 582. Let's take a look here. So, section two, minimum wage increases. Now, if we come down here, A, $8.40 an hour beginning on the effective date under section seven of the Raise of the Wage Act. So it sounds like 840 will it will raise to 840 once this bill passes, which I'm sure it will. The Democrats say that they don't need the Republicans to pass this bill, which obviously they probably don't. I don't think they care what Republicans think, um, so, since they're you know they're in charge of all three branches of government now. <clears throat> they can basically anything they want to do, they're going to get done. So. This is uh, 840 right away is what it'll get bumped up and you know $1.15 from what it is now. Then it'll raise to $9.50 beginning one year after such effective date. So once this bill passes, which we can probably see it, we can probably see this bill pass the same time as um, you know the $1.9 trillion dollar bill that Biden proposed <clears throat> gets passed. Uh, so I would imagine this would take effect somewhere in March, maybe late March for the 840. So the 950 you're probably looking at March of 2022. <clears throat> then it just increases basically yearly after that. It'll go to 1060, a uh, dollar and 10 cents each time. Uh, two years after that, so March 2023, then a dollar and ten, or a dollar ten more to 11.70 in March 2024, and so on until 15 dollars an hour beginning six years after the effective date, which would be 2027 or so. Uh, and then there's a line H here that actually says beginning the, on the date that is seven years after when this bill passes, um, the amount to be determined by the secretary under subsection H. That doesn't say they're gonna stop at 15, basically. Now, what this means, obviously, 725 is quite low. It hasn't been raised in uh, over a decade, I believe. The minimum wage hasn't. Um, however, once it gets up to 15, it, it, you know, there's a lot of people who are making 16, 17 that have worked at their jobs for 10 years to, to get raises to earn that amount. And, and it's going to, you know, make their salary or hourly wage much less valuable, which is concerning. And people have their concerns about this. But what it means for you is anybody making minimum wage now, you can expect to see this probably in March to go to 840. I, I can't imagine it wouldn't get passed. Um, there's also, you know, a section in there that says even servers, uh, restaurant, you know, waiters and waitresses, this will actually increase their wage as well because restaurants can lower waitresses and waiters wages lower than 725 because they're making tips, but Biden wants to erase that. So we'll see what that does on the economy as far as how well people you know, begin tipping. I imagine people will start to not tip at all or very little, but who knows, you know, nobody really knows. But that is, the, those are the details right now that we have so far regarding the $15 minimum wage um, the Raise the Wage Act. Once again, thanks for making it to the end of the video. 
leave a like it helps me out so much and subscribe when you know when I see my subscriber count go up it, it just makes me so happy and uh, I, I love I, I really want to grow this channel and do news and and financial you know things for you guys in the future have a great rest of your day take it easy